So let's start with the human nervous systems. And under human nervous systems, we will discuss uh, the central nervous system uh, where it consists of the brain and the spinal cord. Okay, And after that, we will discuss the peripheral uh, nervous systems. And there are two types of peripheral nerve. Uh, the spinal nerve. The spinal nerve are the nerves that branched up from the spinal cord. And then so we have cranial nerve, and cranial nerve are the nerve that uh, come out from the brain. After that, we are going to discuss a very important part. Uh, there's a lot of uh, questions that come out from this. Uh, there are the neurons, and there are three types of neurons. The sensory neurons, the motor neurons and uh, the relay neurons, we are going to discuss the structures of them and also the functions of certain part of them. Okay, so a lot of questions almost every year that the questions come out uh, that ask you about neurons. Okay, so just now we have learned that the nervous systems consist of two parts uh, the central nervous systems. Uh, which consists of the brain and the spinal cord and the uh, peripheral nervous systems. Let's start with the central nervous system. So these are the functions of the two central nervous system, the brain and the spinal cord, and make sure that you know about this, okay? So the brain are responsible for thinking, sensors, movement, balancing, control voluntary and involuntary actions. And the spinal cord control the reflex reactions. Peripheral nerve. The peripheral nerve are the nerve that branched out from the brain and the spinal cord. Okay, and uh, its function is to transmit impulses between the central nervous system and the receptors or the effectors. So for the central nervous systems, it controls certain things, but and then for peripheral nerve systems, it transmit impulses. Okay, types of peripheral nerve. Just now we have learned that there are two types of peripheral nerve: uh, the cranial nerve that's uh, branched out from the brain, and uh, the spinal nerve that's come out from the spinal cord, eh? and both of these are in the somatic nervous systems. This is a system that control voluntary actions. Voluntary actions means that uh, it's the actions that you in intended to do. That's what you want to do. Okay, so that's a voluntary actions. Now, um, there are also a nerve that control the involuntary actions. Means uh, the actions that uh, not control really controlled by you. For example, your heartbeat. You can't control your heartbeat. So that is the uh, the involuntary actions, and the nerve that control the involuntary actions uh, is called the, the autonomic nerve systems. So we have somatic nervous systems that control the voluntary actions, and the autonomic nervous systems that control the involuntary actions. Huh? Okay. So let's see the summary. For nervous systems, there are central nervous systems and peripheral nervous system. And for central nervous systems, it consists of the brain and the spinal cord, right? And for peripheral nervous systems, it consists of the somatic nervous system and the autonomic nervous system. Somatic nervous system control the voluntary actions and autonomic nervous system control uh, the involuntary actions. And for somatic nervous systems, there are cranial nerve that come out from the brain and uh, the spinal nerve that uh, come out from the spinal cord.